You know, Curtis, we have that crawl going on across the bottom of the screen with basically hundreds of delays out there. And this is the reason why we have wind chill advisories in effect for Cincinnati, areas north as well as areas west. And what that means is temperatures tonight will feel as though they get down to about 10 to 15 degrees below zero. So bone chattering cold, but not quite as cold as what we were dealing with last week. Currently 21 degrees in Hyde Park, 21 degrees Mount Healthy, 22 in Petersburg, and 23 degrees up the road in Loveland. As we zoom out just a little bit, 23 Hillsboro, 26 in Georgetown, and 18 degrees over in Batesville. So we're starting to see some of those temperatures drop into the teens. And again, that's just half the story. Once you factor in our wind out of the northwest at 15 miles an hour, it feels like 11. And the temperature, as well as the wind chills, will continue to drop to those sub-zero temperatures come tomorrow morning. The WLWT radar showing dry conditions across the tri-state. We actually have a little bit of snow down to our south, down through Tennessee, Arkansas, and Missouri. A big storm system causing a lot of problems for areas like Dallas, Oklahoma City, and now it's pressing off to the east. This is the exact same storm track of our President's Day snowstorm we had last week, with one exception. We have high pressure to our north, and that's going to keep that system south. So instead of seeing snow, we're just going to see a whole ton of cold air. And you can see how chilly this air is. Seven below in Minneapolis, 14 below in Marquette, and of course even colder in Canada. We're going to have a few chances this week to set some record lows. I think one on Tuesday morning and another shot as we head into Friday morning. But every day this week is going to be cold until we get to next weekend. So your forecast tomorrow starting off at one wind chills at about 10 to 15 degrees below zero. As we head to the afternoon, the winds will gradually back off our high 15 with most Mostly sunny skies all around a nice sunny day, but those temperatures not reflecting all the hard work of that sunshine. Future cast showing tonight clouds gradually clearing out. Tomorrow morning, sunny skies by the afternoon. We're still sunny, and again, all the clouds and snow well down to our south. Now, on Tuesday, another system is going to drop in from the north, and that's going to give us one of those reinforcing shots of colder weather, and that's why this cold air just sticks around and really doesn't go anywhere. So your forecast tonight, down to one wind chills between 10 and 15, perhaps even down to as cold as 20 in some of the outlying communities, 20 below zero, that is. Temperatures tomorrow afternoon, 15 degrees, still cold, but hey, finally some sunshine. It'll look a little nicer outside anyway. Tuesday morning, I put that little star there to indicate a record low if we hit five below. 24 degrees the afternoon high, another record possible on Friday morning at six below zero, and then by next weekend, 33 on Saturday. We'll have to watch out, maybe a late mix there, sleet, snow, and then eventually changing over to rain on Sunday with, ah, oh, that sounds so nice, 45 degrees.